This is an introduction to chaining. Given two known locations, point A and point B, how can we find the distance between them? There are several tools necessary for this exercise. Pins, steel tape, palm bobs, hand level, and the tension meter. To measure short distances, place two pins crisscrossed at point A and another pair at point B. Have two workers hold the steel tape at both ends, lining up the plumb bobs over the pins. Use the hand level to ensure the elevation from point A is the same at both ends of the tape. The tension meter should read 20 pounds of force before taking the final reading. The distance measured by the steel tape from point A to point B will be the horizontal distance. In some cases, such as going down a steep incline, it is impossible to level out both ends of the tape. The sharp incline can be split into smaller chunks as shown. This is known as breaking down the chain. The horizontal distance is equal to D1 plus D2. Be careful to make sure the measured points line up. The steel tape can only measure for the total length of the tape, in this case, 100 feet. Similar to the method of breaking down the chain, intermediate points may be used to measure the total distance. Like before, the horizontal distance is equal to D1 plus D2. The measured point should match up if measuring in a straight line.